All right, so I've got like a bunch of random stuff here and like stuff that was like half finished and I've like cut it up and let's see how it's, how it's gonna taste. Okay, so we're gonna start off with this leftover onion and bell pepper. So I've cut it small and I'm gonna put it in there. I'm gonna oil. I'm also gonna add a little bit of salt and some black pepper. Okay, so you can see the salt and like the random pepper flakes around and I'm just gonna mix it up. All right, so the thing's like a bit cooking now. Um, I didn't put in a bunch of oil because it doesn't need to be like oily fried. But um, so now I'm gonna add in this like chopped minced chili um, onto it. The chili doesn't need to be there too long to cook. It, it just needs a good stir so that it's like mixed in with all the stuff. And now we're gonna add in the rice. All right. So once you've add, you need to add like rice, and then like it takes a while to like break it up and mix it around and do stuff. I don't think it's supposed to add water. Um, but I did. <laughs> So it's too lazy to like wait, um, but now when, once it's kind of like separated and not all stuck together, you can add in the toasted carrots. Um, so I'm gonna do that. And so now I'm just gonna turn off the heat and add in all the cut cabbage and then mix it around. Alright, so this is pretty much it. I added a little, little bit of excess salt and pepper, but it's kind of meant to be a bit plain because I'm gonna add the chicken. Okay, so now I'm gonna add this chicken, and I'm gonna I'm gonna break it apart. Um, so this, hold up, <laughs> hold up. All right, so this chicken, um, has ran a bunch of random stuff, spices in my pantry in it. It has cardamom, as you can see that. It has garam masala. It has salt. It has um chili powder. It has a bit of oil. That's why I didn't add more here, but I might add more anyway. Um, and it has a uh, nutmeg. So yeah, I, I don't know how this is gonna taste. Um, so I better start praying. All right, so this is looking pretty good already, but I've just added some water and okay, this might ruin it. <laughs> added some water and cornstarch to the original thing where the chicken was, and so I'm gonna add it in and stir it around and see what that does. All right, so I just added it. Now all the chicken is glossy. I was thinking maybe like if you add like sugar or some. I don't know, some spice or something like coating into there and you put it on after that, that would like coat all the chicken in something cool. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm a, I, I think this is good now, so I'm gonna put it on. Okay guys, this is the final dish. Um, I think it looks pretty cool, I think it looks pretty schnazzy. Oh, well, uh, the, the freaking, okay, let me turn on the light. I think it looks pretty schnazzy. Um, uh, I hope to see you another day and I hope this doesn't poison me. But if I do get sick, I get an extension on my assignment, which is really good. Um, but yeah, let's see how it tastes. Alright, here goes nothing. Mmm. Okay, the chicken isn't raw. This is kind of bland, but it's okay. Because chicken has flavour. That one can just too bad. The vegetables add a bit more texture. I'll give it... I'll say it's good. I'll say it's a good 6.5. I'll see you next time. Alright, I'm lowering this down. Uh, to a 5.5. It's, it's slightly better than average, I think. Because this tastes good. But it leaves a lot to be desired. Like, I, I'm adding this sriracha. Right now. To add more of a sauce, I, I I think that thing where I added like the cornstarch, develop I I, I could have like committed to that more and like added more flavorings to that, and then it would have been good. Um, but yeah, that's that's it.